Thor, talk about the hockey game. Obviously, not the result there, but defensively, it seemed like you guys were under pressure all night long. Yeah, I think uh, them taking the loss last night, they were coming hard, and uh, it took us a while to get our feet underneath us, and uh, I think it was too late by the time we did. What do you think the messages from the coaching staff? I mean, you know, the desperation for the Lumberjacks is there, but in terms of playing steel hockey, quote, uh, how do you get back to that? Uh, I think we just show up to work on Monday again after a long weekend and get back to work and get back to our game next weekend. I mean, obviously not the result we wanted tonight, so I think we just learned from that and get after it again this week. For you individually, what has been the most challenging part about adapting to USHL and how much better do you feel game 30 as opposed to game 13? Yeah, I think just uh, I'm obviously getting more comfortable every game I play in, and uh, uh, it was pretty challenging, the speed and skill of the League is obviously a lot more challenging than high school, so it was a big jump at first, but I think every game I'm getting better, and uh, tonight wasn't one of them, but uh, the other ones have been pretty good. I have to agree with that, Coco Buff. Uh, what are you working on in your game individually right now that's blossoming? Uh, well, besides tonight, I think uh, working on the D zone, my stick detail, playing the body a little more, getting into hands, and uh, making the easy pass for the breakouts, getting it up to our forwards' hands quickly. Thanks a lot, Coco Buff. Enjoy the rest of your weekend. Thank you.